Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Come it like a cherry. Come it like a cherry. Your oh, boy done switched up on you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look, if this is your very first time on this channel, run over there and subscribe for me. And after you subscribe, make sure you hit the notification bell beside the word subscribe so that you'll be notified each and every time that we upload a video. And then, welcome to the Lips family. Now, now that you're part of the Lips family, there's something that I need for you to do. That thing is comment, comment, comment like share and go for the team. Comment like to share and go for the team. Comment, like, and share, and don't forget to comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Don't forget to comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Don't forget to. Don't forget to comment, like, and share. Okay, you guys, we're going to pray and get right into the food. Here we go. Amen. Okay, y'all, today we have got five guys. We've got five guys today, you guys. Today, I have a bacon cheeseburger, and I have one of the dogs. I've got the bacon cheese dog, okay? Here, I've got mayonnaise, the regular, you know what I eat. I get the mayonnaise, extra, extra pickles. I've got lettuce, no tomatoes, but I've got mushrooms and sauteed onions on here. On the dog, I've got bacon, I've got mushrooms, I've got jalapenos, I've got green peppers, cheese, onion. But we got to work. We just got some regular fries. I've got ketchup over here to the side. And Big Ben is in the building, baby. Big Ben is here. Big Ben is here to help me out. Because this is a lot of food. And I'm going to try to eat it. Let's see if he's nice and refreshing. Yes, he is. Okay, y'all, let me give me some ketchup down here. Give me some ketchup down here, honey. So we can get to eating. Mmm. 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 You guys, this is my first time having five guys. I got my fries Cajun. Mmm. I've never had it before. Mmm. 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 And they're all over Memphis. There's two in very, very close proximity in my house. Oh, and I've seen it on YouTube. Look here. Okay, y'all. That's where the bacon is. I've seen it on YouTube many, 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 many times before. But I'm going to see what it's working with. Mmm. 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 That's good. I mean, it's really good. I wouldn't give it the best burger in the world, but it's good. It really is. Mmm. It's kind of greasy, but satisfying. It's like it doesn't have too much grease in it. Just enough. You know where it don't taste greasy. Let me put me some ketchup on it. Mmm. Mmm. It's definitely good, though. Mm-hmm. Mm. So how y'all doing? Happy Monday, happy Monday, happy Monday! Mm-hmm. 
we start this week out again together. Mm-hmm. We start the week out together again. Oh. Kids back in school. Mm-hmm. I'm sure by now everybody is what is a little fall break. It's over with by now. So all the little rug rats is going on back to school. Mm-hmm. So back to business as usual. Back to business as usual, y'all. All right, y'all. Y'all know I got to try this. This burger. Give it all. Oh, y'all, some of my pickles fell off. And my meat. Y'all, I dropped some of my meat. Let me get my meat back. Y'all, let's see what the real deal is with it. Let's see. Mmm. Mmm, hmm. Mmm, hmm. Now I see what they're talking about. But this burger needs a little hot sauce. It needs a little wake up. It needs a little wake up. Mm hmm. Now, that time, I could taste. You know, like the texture of the mushrooms and everything. That needs the lips hot sauce, definitely. Okay, y'all. Oh. Here's the hot dog. Do it like that. There's the hot dog. I got some relish over here to the side. Let me put a little relish on it. I like relish. Let's see. Mmm. Mmm. Now that's bomb. That hot dog is real bomb. Mmm-hmm. Now that's a good hot dog. Mmm. So how was your weekend? How was your weekend, y'all? I don't know whether you've been keeping up or you've been paying attention. But y'all, by the end of today, I'll be willing to say, by the end of the day, we should be at 10K. Hey, hey, y'all, by the end of the day, we should hit it. We should hit it. We right there at the door. Y'all, I am so thankful. I am so thankful, you guys. I really, I am so thankful. When I started this, I thought I would do well. But you guys just cannot, you just can't know the overwhelming feeling of joy, love, and acceptance that I feel from you guys. I love you guys so, so, so much. I really do. I love you guys so much. I know I'm going to have to put some more reddish on this dog. I know that because I like this hot dog. Oh, y'all look. Out of everything in that hot, in that hot dog, I dropped my jalapeno. Hold up. Hold up. Mmm. This hot dog is busting. Mm-hmm. Y'all, this good. 
Mm-hmm. Mm. I still never heard from Miss Tracy. T-R-A-C-Y. You have said T-R-A. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I know y'all ain't got time for my shenanigans early this Monday morning, honey. But T R A C Y. Miss Tracy. Get with me, baby doll. So I can see you in your hot sauce, okay? Mm-hmm. Y'all make sure y'all be checking. I'm trying to put them out in the community post. But if I miss the community post, what, whatever I see it, I'm definitely going to save it to the playlist. So keep checking the playlist. Uh, Y'all, Big Ben be saving me. Big Ben be pushing that food down in my stomach. Baby, I couldn't make without Big Ben. Mm. Mm. Y'all, this hot dog got more bacon on it than most the restaurants give you on a big burger. On like a big double burger. Mm-hmm. I would say that they definitely put a lot of, um, thought into giving the customer value. They wasn't cheap now. But I would willing to say if I'm gonna pay six dollars for a hot dog, it better be as good as that is. That for sure. But it meets my approval. If that's a good six dollar hot dog. <laughs> it is. Oh. So y'all, it's getting that time of the year. It's getting to that time of the year to where the whole Black Friday, Cyber Monday, Hotel Thursday, and all, <laughs> all that finna get kicked up. Hotel Thursday. Mm. So, for the holidays, you know the shopping frenzy that goes on this time of year. Are you a get up and go out for the experience type of person? Or run around to the stores? Or are you a just, I'll do it online type person? I've experienced both. As long as you safe and you make it home and safe, the rush of being out there with all those people is great. I like the rush of being out there with all the people, what I used to anyway. I haven't been now for the last couple of years. Obviously, you know why. But when I did do it, you know, the anticipation of are you going to get what it is that you came to get, that was, that was, that was, I mean, I, I mean, it'd be so many people. I'm saying that whole rush that you got from trying to get what you came for. You know what I'm saying? That was cool. But being out there getting trampled by folks, ain't nothing cool about that. There's nothing at all. It's just amazing to me how over a few short years, how we find a way to mess up everything. We really do. We really do. Mm. People be fighting, shooting. For real. People be losing their life. 
So I'm going to be up in Walmart. Yeah, it ain't worth that. I mean, it just ain't worth that. How do you go from leaving your house to get an item on sale to leaving, you know, in an ambulance or in a cop car, depending on which side of the corner you on, honey? Y'all, this has been good. I truly enjoyed this. This is my first time ever having this before. I've never eaten five guys. Like I said, there's, there's two really close to my home. I pass them all the time, but I just have never eaten that before. This is really good. But anyway, how do you do that? How do you go from trying to save a little money? You know, get the kids criminals and all of that. So going to jail. Or to the hospital. Just like I said, some kind of way, we always find a way to mess it up. It don't matter how good it could be. Really, I mean, we're going to find a way to mess it up. For real. Us over here. We seem to be the worst country to get along. We can't get along for nothing. We just cannot get along with each other. We just cannot. Over here in the U.S. of A., where we free at, we always find a way not to be a hand in hand. Or bring it to each other. We find ways to separate. We find more ways to separate ourselves. Y'all ain't gonna get on that. Ah. I'm gonna leave it alone, y'all, cause I don't wanna take no chance of them them bugging my phone. <laughs> hey! So I'm gonna leave that alone. Hmm. Hmm. Y'all, this five guy is busting. The burger was good, but the hot dog was best. It really was. I ain't give y'all none to look Cajun fries. Y'all see look Cajun fries. They were good too, though. The Cajun fry was good. They were good. Oh, Lord, excuse me. Oh, last bite, y'all. Last bite. This hot dog was divine. The next time I go back here, I'm just gonna get all hot dogs. Mm-hmm. I made you the fries, but I'm just gonna get like three hot dogs as opposed to getting the hamburger. The hot dog was super busting. The hamburger was good. I can see why people saying like it's so 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 good. It's the best hamburger you know. I can see why a person could say that if you didn't grow up in the country. Or you didn't grow up where good food was prevalent to you. I can see you saying that. Because that is a good burger. But baby, I have had some old low down, some old low down burgers, honey. But I've had some old low down burgers. From the side store. Or mess around and been out to the club or something. And got towed up. And mess around in a... Or maybe less than desirable neighborhood. <laughs> hey! Let me ask y'all something. Have y'all ever been to a restaurant where you went to get like this style of food? You know, you know, burgers greasy, fried hot dogs, somewhat greasy, 
French fries, fried, greasy, you know, that type of thing, that good, you know, that good after the club um, a menu that you're really looking for. And when you went to it, you may have been in a neighborhood that you weren't used to or whatever. Or it could be one of your favorite places. You know, you know the place like you you drive to this place, you know, to get what you wanted to get. I think we all got that little favorite little hole in the wall meal place where we go and get something that we know gonna be just like we wanted every time. But anyway, and look, when you go up in the place, like you can't see in the back where they cook it. Or maybe you can, but you have to order it like through a glass, like through a bulletproof window, something like that. Have y'all ever been to a place like that, baby? A place like that, go have the best hamburger you ever that you ever put your mouth on. I don't know what it is about those type of places. You know, it's cooking on like those flat grills back there in the back, and it's a little bit of tight little, you know, you know, just a little bit of tight cooking. I don't know what to call it, but. You know it be them little bit of tight places. You know, they don't be big as nothing. You know, you kind of come in the door, and then the little place where you can eat it be like right over here on one, you know, be like right over here down one, um, you know, one row. And then you got the, the, the thing where you got the bulletproof glass or the bars or whatever, and you order through that and get your money through that. Give them your money through the little whole thing. And then... You, they cook your food back there behind. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I hope y'all have. I hope y'all have. Maybe y'all had never seen, but it's places like that here in Memphis. And baby, that's going to be the best hamburger that you're going to ever find. I'm telling you. Little old out of the cold spot like that, that you run up in, you know, pay, you know, $250, $350, $4 for a hamburger. Because you hung over, dr intoxicated. Baby, them be the best hamburger that you ever put in your mouth. Right there at them type of places. If you got one, or if you know what one is, and you just ain't never been in there, because like I said, most of the time, they're in kind of less desirable neighborhood. Okay. Now, I have seen one one time that was just like that. That was an upscale in a very nice neighborhood, but they're just a the style of restaurant that it was. That's just how they done it. So, but anyway, if you know what one is, that you ain't never been to because you just really just want to stop in that neighborhood. Get you a friend or two and go on over there and get you one of them burgers at that place. I bet you, you're going to say the same thing I'm telling you. I don't know what it is about them places, but they make the best burgers in the world. Don't mess around and pay that extra 60, 70 cent for some bacon, baby. <laughs> you might not want to go back on your side of town and eat. I don't know, but I'm telling you, if you try it, Generally, it's gonna be it's gonna come in a brown paper, just a brown paper bag or something like that, <laughs> or the white paper bag. I don't know, but I'm telling you, they'll be the best places in the world to get a hamburger. At. They'll be the best. Anyway, y'all better get up out of here. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I really, really enjoyed. This is my first time having five guys. It was amazing. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love you guys so 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 much. We back at it, y'all. Today Monday, so I'm gonna see you tomorrow so we can make it through the week. We got to make it through the week, y'all. I hope you guys have had a great morning. I hope the kids got out to school safely and that they're having a good time. Today is the start of the week, y'all. Don't forget, put it on your agenda to treat yourself right all week long. Put it on your agenda to find somebody's day to brighten up all week long. And I'm going to be right here to talk to you all week long, too. Okay. I look, there goes somebody. Look, there y'all go. I almost made it. No, I think it went out one other time, but I just stopped. But anyway, y'all finna get up out of here. I love you guys so, so, so much. Okay. Anyway, if you want the Lip Tots house, go over to the community post. The instructions for you to get it is right there. I love you guys so, so, so much. And we finna get up out of here, okay? We finna go, we finna go, we finna go. I love you guys. Don't forget to pray for everybody in the prayer list. And I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow, okay? All right. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look, always remember that there's always more than one way home. All you have to do is get there. So get there, people, get there. I love you all, and I'm going to see you guys next time. But if you're not here to watch me next time, you have lied to me. And I know you lied. Period. Bye-bye. Mwah. 
Yeah, that was good. That was really good. That was really good. Big Ben says 